video, I would like to give you an up course and candid review on how you can install FM WhatsApp. I have already made a comprehensive video on how you can download FM WhatsApp from scratch. Without much ado, let's get started. So what you are required to do is just get into your phone files or file manager, but basically in most Android device, I would advise you to use file. After clicking the option file, uh, you'll be prompted by an interface like this. After getting into this interface, you shall come to where to the option apps. So in the apps in the apps option is divided into two sections. We have the installed apps and app install file. So these app in install files they are files which are not already installed in your gadget. So what you are required to do is just click above this file so after clicking it you'll be pretty sure that installation process have now started so it will take actually two to three minutes based with the speed of your phone so just hit install and let's wait we shall check using my phone though my phone is a bit rallish but we hope it will not take long as we are waiting, please don't forget to give the video a thumb up and also a subscription so that you will not be missing out any of my future hour in content like this. So let's remain patient as we are installing FM WhatsApp. So let's wait. Basically, it will take around two, to not more than two minutes. It's just actually one minute. We shall be through and be able now to start the process of getting into FM WhatsApp interface and being able to interact with FM WhatsApp. So let's wait for a few minutes and see and being able to log in. So after the installation process commenced, you'll be actually be prompted either to click done to get the interface in the home screen or just to open it direct but in our case we shall just open it direct but you can choose to click done then open it from the home but for time purpose so you shall wait now to be prompted into the interface which will help us now to create a whatsapp account or basically the fm whatsapp account but all of them they are just whatsapps so that's why you have simply called it to create a whatsapp account since so then after getting here now you'll be told welcome to whatsapp you just choose the language which you are conversant with but basically i use english so if you basically if you had a previous fm whatsapp or another whatsapp and uh, you had backup to your data you can just choose to restore backup but in my case i don't want to rescue anything i just want to create a new account and just click agree and continue after hitting the button so my phone is a bit crappy that's why it says you get this dark thing appearing so then i'll be prompted to enter my contact for to confirm my identity if I am human being or a robot but basically I am a human being so they you know have, have put less numbers let me put the contact again again let me put it again have detected I've put a shorter number than possible then click next so you just input your contact and then click next so this is the normal creation of a whatsapp account i'll be told to confirm if this the number is correct basically is correct then you choose the verification method you can either choose to receive verification through a missed call for your phone or just to verify in another way basically we'll verify it in another way for my personal reasons so that it can send an sms or what most people call a verification code so in case you experience a delay in verification code i have also created a comprehensive video which i also put in the description on what you can do in case you experience a rug when getting a verification code so the verification code is here 
that uh, I have inputted. So we are lucky we have not received a rag. So you just input your name, either a hypothetical name or just your the name which you like using. So it will be shown in people when you are logging into WhatsApp group. So you use my name. You can choose a profile picture if need be, but in our case, I will not add it. Let's continue. So uh, the initializing process have commenced. Now we'll be able to have an FM WhatsApp account. So don't worry if you get an option like this, since th this is because you have not given FM WhatsApp permission to access your gadget. You're just getting to settings as you are being prompted. Then grant FM WhatsApp permission. You can give it permission to access your contact first. This is very important. Just click around. You just also allow it to access your location if need be. Another important thing is your camera if you want to be sharing photos. Another important thing is also your storage. And uh, after doing that, I think you are good to go and uh, continue using FM WhatsApp. So thank you for watching and bon appetit.